It was a busy and productive day on campus today for the Badgers. Not only did the Wisconsin basketball team land their first two commitments for next year, and point guard Demetric Trice, he's the brother of Michigan State's Travis Trice, and his IMG teammate, Aleem Ford. The football team also got their ninth commit for next year in defensive end Isaiah Green May. He was in town for the spring game, as well as Hawaii transfer cornerback Nick Nelson. Speaking of that spring game, or shall we call it a glorified spring practice? But running back Corey Clement treated this play like a real game in midseason form. He rolls around the left side and into the end zone. He said afterwards he was just happy to be healthy and be out there. How about this now? Alex Hornibrook, the freshman quarterback, going deep over the top to George Rushing. 46 yards in all, one of two touchdowns from Hornibrook to Rushing on the afternoon. Bart Houston got in some work at quarterback as well. The nice dump off here to Bradrick Shaw. Houston, 7-14 for 73 yards. Paul Christ wanted to see some defense in these highlights, so ask and you shall receive. Ryan Conley getting in the backfield for the tackle for loss, but Team Aberderis and the offense knocked off Team Schobert and the D, 28-22. Sports Director Mike Jocks has more from the camp. Ryan, thank you very much. What a tough assignment today. Spend the day in the sun at Camp Randall Stadium for the spring game. Yeah, we'll take it. The Badgers took it as well. They perform well here on the field of Camp Randall Stadium. And overall, Paul Christ happy with how the day went. I thought our kids had, had good energy, and um, but had it all had it all spring. And that's what I, I really liked about the group and appreciated from it. Our team took advantage of the opportunities presented to us to get better. Well, I'm joined now by Lucas Mayer. And Lucas, I told you this would not be a bad day today, and it turned out to be awesome. No, it was beautiful out. It was beautiful out. And, you know, essentially we were, we were looking at a glorified practice, but that's mm -hmm. okay. And, uh, I mean, to me, the most interesting thing is the quarterback competition. We yep. still we don't know that much. Alex Hornibrook, he had a great day. He did. He had a couple of really deep passes, but we still don't really know what's going to happen about this. Uh, it's going to go into fall camp until it's decided between Alex Hornibrook and uh, Bart Houston for the starting quarterback. Everybody's in a fresh new role. You know, Bart uh, Hornibrook are you know competing amongst the first spot. So, uh, you know, I think competition is going to drive the both of them. And uh, come September, and uh, I think we'll we'll see who's going to play that first role. So at 10 o'clock, we're going to delve a little bit more into this QB competition and what we've seen between Hornibrook and Houston through 15 practices. It certainly will be interesting. I thought the defense played well today they as did. well. You know, the quarterbacks did what they had to do, but uh, the defense, they're going to be pretty good as well. Yeah, they're absolutely going to be good, and I think that the defense is going to need to basically carry this team uh, for them to succeed next season. Lots of things to talk about in the offseason and more to talk about coming up tonight at 10. For Lucas Mayer, I'm Mike Jocks at Camp Randall Stadium.